everyone. Thank you for tuning in. Today's recipe, I will show you how to make mango crunching buns. I am Rosie. You are welcome to my kitchen. Ingredients, I'll be using mangoes. I will start by cutting the mangoes and they are nicely washed already. You can use any type of mangoes for this recipe. Cut into cubes. Use a spoon to bring it out. Repeat the process until everything is done. Next, transfer the cut mangoes inside a blender. And blend it into a smooth paste. That is done. I'll put that aside. Next, I'll be using flour, sugar, baking powder, butter. You can also use mandarin. In a bowl, I'll place in the sift. I'll measure in flour. I'm using all purpose flour. You can also use a plain flour as well. Add baking powder and sift. Sugar, you can use more or less sugar. Powder milk. Salt. Mix them together. I'll create a well in the middle of the bowl. Next ingredients, I'll be using eggs. In a bowl, I'll crack into eggs. Add vanilla extract. Mix them together. To the dry ingredients, add the eggs and the vanilla extract, melted butter, add the mango puree. This recipe is a new recipe and a special recipe as well. My kids taught me how to make it they did not see it anywhere. They just came about it and it has become a recipe for us. They made it for me on Mother's Day. It was the best buns I've ever had. I kept asking for more buns and they were like, Mom, I thought you're watching your weight. I said not today. You all should give this recipe a try. The measurement will be down in the description box below of this video. So what we are making today is the crunching buns. If you don't like the crunching buns, you can make it to be a little bit lighter than this paste here. I'll cover it with a napkin just to rest for about 10 minutes.
next i'll be using avocado oil to fry you can use any oil of your choice and i'll add the oil in the pan allow the oil to heat up i will check the temperature with a skewer once you see bubbles around the sticks that means the oil is hot and it's been 10 minutes Stay it for a couple of seconds. Do not overstay. I'll be using ice cream scoop. You can also use your hands. It's totally up to you. And I'm frying on medium heat. If the oil is too hot, the buns is going to fry outside and it will be uncooked inside it so we're frying it on medium heat i'll use a skewer to flip them so they can fry evenly for crunching buns, when you're frying it, they are going to crack. So if you don't like the crack buns, you're going to make the dough to be lighter than the one I miss. Today's shown is crunching buns. So once they are golden brown, they are ready. I'll take them out of the hot oil and I've already prepared a strainer with a paper towel to transfer them in there and the paper towel will take out any excess oil from the burns. Before adding the next batch, I'll clean the oil like so. And I will add the next batch and fry them until they are golden brown as well. Once they are ready, I'll take them out of the oil. mango buns is ready i'm gonna be having it with some freshly squeezed juice this buns was very very delicious you all should give this recipe a try i'm just gonna open it so you can see it is crunchy outside but super moist inside it and the color was so so beautiful if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up and share and follow me if you are not already thank you all so much for watching remain blessed i will see you in my next video bye